Greetings from the Grace Bible Presbyterian Church of Cape Canaveral, Florida. We are really looking forward to hosting the 84th General Synod. We are all aware that this synod was supposed to be held last year in Grand Island, New York, and earlier this year the decision was made to move here to Florida. We are ready to welcome you come August. We've published the registration information for our General Senate. In fact, I'm holding it here in my hands. Now, let me just make one thing clear that is, I think, somewhat unique about our denomination. That registration is with the local church. We're offering meals. And I encourage you, if you're able, to, to take those meals with one another for the purpose of fellowship. We've arranged a great rate at the Canaveral Towers condo. Uh, which is down the road from the church, right on the beach. Some beautiful condos, beautiful views of the beach at $100 a night for a two-bedroom. And we think that's a great deal. Encourage you to share that. It also has a kitchenette, uh, so you can cook meals on Saturday uh, or for breakfast or, or whatever. Uh, so really nice. Uh, the information is there. We also do have some, some host homes that we can make available on a first-come, first-serve basis. Now, when you register with the church, that has nothing to do with your registration with the Senate. You will register with the stated clerk on the opening day of Senate, and that's a little card that the stated clerk will, will uh, have for you at the clerk's table. There's no fee to be an enrolled voting delegate at our General Senate. The meals, the registration with the church, the housing, is just really for your convenience and to facilitate the fellowship of our General Senate. Now, I do want to draw your attention to the meal uh, registration form. Last time we had Senate, uh, several people just went down and picked one of everything, which created a problem then because that means they, uh, a gentleman, one of our pastors, signed up for both the, the lunch on Friday and the ladies' luncheon. And you can't be in two places at once, and the ladies' luncheon is just for ladies. So there are three meals in which you get to pick so the Thursday dinner, we're having a food truck cater it, and you get to pick chicken or per pork. Chicken or pork. So pick one. It's barbecue, chicken, or pork. Friday's lunch, you have three choices. That is when the ladies' luncheon is. And then for those of us left behind, there will be Chick-fil-A sandwiches, and you can choose original or spicy. On Monday night, there are three choices uh, for our banquet at the Cocoa Beach Hilton, there's a pork, a chicken, or a pork, a mahi mahi, and a chicken option. So you want to pick one person, one item per person. I suppose if you find yourself very hungry and you want to order more than one, uh, it's up to you. But generally speaking, one per person. One last note from us here, as we are desiring that this would be a general synod and there would be good participation. Certainly we know there are providentially hindrances which will keep some people away, but don't let money be one of those. If you have a need or you hear of somebody who has a need, please reach out. We would love to help supplement and make sure as many men and elders, pastors and elders, can come to our general synod. Lord bless you. We're praying for you. We look forward to seeing you on August 5th.